Hey, what's up? It's Jake from Nimbus DevOps, and I'm going to talk to you now about HMAC. So this module implements the HMAC algorithm as described in RFC 2104, which you can feel free to go read all of the extremely boring documentation on that. Um, an HMAC, which stands for High Based Message Authentication Code, or Key Hash Message Authentication Code, depending on who you ask, is a widely used mechanism for authenticating messages and verifying that they have not been tampered with. So the algorithm combines a message with a secret key and generates a hash of the combination of the two. The hash is referred to as a MAC, or a Message Authentication Code, or a signature. The signature is stored or transmitted along with the message. At a later time, you can verify the message hasn't been tampered with by recomputing the signature using the same secret key and comparing it to the previously computed signature. So the secret key must be carefully protected. Um, otherwise, an attacker with access to the key could be able to modify a message and replace the signature, completely defeating the authentication mechanism. So what does that look like? Well, let's make a little script and we'll see what that looks like. So I'm going to make a hmc.py and we're going to import hmac and we're going to import hashlib and that's all you'll need. So in here I'm going to define a function. I'm going to call it calc digest and it's going to take key and message arguments and the key is going to be equal to bytes key and we're going to format that in UTF-8 and then our message is going to be in bytes uh, whatever the message is passed and we will also form format that in UTF-8 and then we're also going to make a dig which is going to be hmac.new and it's going to say key message and then our hash, so hashlib dot SHA-256. Then all we will do is we will return the hexa, uh, hexadecimal digest, so hex digest of our dig. Okay? Then I can just create a variable called mac, call calc digest, and pass a secret key. And then we need a message, right? So in our message will be some kind of important message that we want encrypted. All right. So the hmac.new function takes a secret key and a message and a hash algorithm to use and returns an hmac object. So it has a similar interface to the hash objects from hashlib. The key must be a bytes or byte array object and the message can be any bytes like object. Um, so we convert our key and message into bytes before creating an HMAC instance which is we're calling dig. So we'll use this to get a hexadecimal representation of the hash and you'll see a little bit more about how HMAC signatures can be used later um, when we start talking about uh, Java web tokens uh, or JSON web tokens. Before that, however, we'll take a quick look in the next section on secrets. But let's go ahead and run this and see what happens. So let me make sure I'm in the right directory. Python scripts. And we will just run Python HMC. And there we go. And if I wanted to, I could like print. Oops. Hey, how's it going? Print Mac so you can see it. And there we go. So it's just that simple. So that is uh, everything you know to get started with HMAC.